The recently concluded police recruitment exercise has been riddled with allegations of irregularities prompting heated debate in Parliament. The debate was sparked by Kiminini MP Chris Wamalwa, who sought a statement from the National Administration and Security Committee Chair Asman Kamama over the status of probing the matter. Kamama revealed to the House that the committee has already written a letter to the Commission to postpone the reporting date for the new recruits from 5th of August pending the completion of its investigations. When young police officers, you know, get to know that they went into the service after, you know, you know, after, you know, their parents or friends uh, did some bribery, I think, uh, I think we are, we are going to entrench corruption from, 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 from uh, from the word go. A section of MPs, however, demanded the cancellation of the entire exercise, maintaining it was riddled with corruption, tribalism, and nepotism, calling for a fresh recruitment exercise. Deputy Speaker Joyce Laboso ordered the committee to launch immediate investigations into the matter, even as she called on the National Police Service Commission to extend the reporting deadline for the 10,000 recruits pending the outcome of the committee's report. The National Police Service Commission yesterday revealed it had received over 300 complaints regarding the recruitment exercise and has since launched investigations. However, MPs led by Kipipiri MP Samuel Gishigi raised concerns arguing that the commission cannot be relied on to investigate itself.